What's up guys, this is the intention for the workout on Monday, August 31st. Starting with an 18 minute E3 mom focused on weightlifting. It's gonna be six rounds. For the tactical, we're looking at three of these clean and jerks. We're, we're trying to have a full reset in between the reps. We put it all the way down, shake things out, come back into it. Uh, nice, powerful clean, really focusing on speed, working up to about 75% by the end of this, but really just dialing in the technique and uh, trying to be explosive. Each round, uh, if you're not adjusting weights, if you're not using too much time for that, trying to do a few of these shoulder stability exercises, the set of Y's, T's, W, and the A as well. You can do this with nothing, really just isometrically squeezing and holding, trying to uh, stabilize those shoulders. You can also do this with a band, attaching that to uh, any kind of, uh, any kind of uh, stationary object in front of you and squeezing that through again, making that nice big Y, making the T's, W's and then they're really trying to, to dial in that rotator cuff and, and stabilize that shoulder in between. And the last way to do this would be just laying supinated um, using gravity. Same pattern with those shoulders, squeezing everything together. For the practice, we're looking at three of these single arm uh, kettlebell clean to press, three on each side. So I'm performing three on one side and bringing it back in, swinging, catching it on my shoulder, and then however you like to press it over top. It can be a trick press, it could be a push press, it could be a jerk if you'd like it to be. But again, three and three each round. Following that with 20 of these hollow body rocks, really making sure to keep that spine curved, rolling through about your coccyx to about your mid back. Um, and again, just trying to dial in that core. You can also use this as an opportunity to open up those shoulders and really reach up. And then again, here we're finishing each round, uh, focusing on those, on those shoulders. Y's, T's, W's, and A's really just Nailing in those details, waking up that rotator cuff, making sure those shoulders are strong. Work capacity here is gonna be a, a fast paced 10 minute AMRAP. Tactical, we're looking at 10 of these thrusters, making finding a weight that you're able to do 10 times and then again, continuing to come back to it. Again, it is an AMRAP over 10 minutes. We also have 10 of these burpee over bar, dropping all the way down, touching that chest, hopping laterally over the bar you could just turn and 
and face it once you start to get tired. Practical version is gonna be pretty much the same. It's 10 thrusters. We're just breaking it up over two arms. You have a single kettlebell or dumbbell at home, uh, five on one side, five on the other. And then we're combining that with just a standard burpee here. Dropping all the way down, tapping that chest, having a little nice little hop at the top. You could also make this an OG burpee if you're feeling extraordinarily tired. You know, take the push up out of it, just drop it to a plank and drop back and jump up, up at the top. All right, that's it for the workout. Thanks for watching. Comment in the comments, and I'll see you later.